guys welcome back to my channel first of all i would like to thank you everybody for kind of watching my first video i never thought like that many people's gonna watch it but it seems like a lot of people liked it and a few people kind of suggested too so i'm gonna keep improving and also uh, today in this video i'm gonna go over like how can you make consistent income selling options so basically i'm gonna go over selling put so selling put in option there's always two part one is buyer and one is seller so whenever you're buying and put option so somebody is selling it so how can you become the uh, put seller so i'm gonna kind of go through that and i'm using webull for that i really like webull uh, if you want to try i have a link below just um, try it's 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 a zero commission but it's a lot better than Robinhood. i do have a Robinhood account that's why i got it started too I mean, I had other accounts too before that too, but uh, you know, you can bid the free commission. So Webull is free too, but there's platform is really beautiful and I'm gonna kind of show you everything. So uh, you can look into this at the top. This is a desktop app. Uh, they have a mobile app too, which is pretty good. But um, look at this. Uh, so this is basically a, a watch list, which you can create, you can add it in your watch list and that was my kind of watch list and uh, looks like pretty much everything's like salesforce is up uh, facebook's was up big today um, i had some spread on that one anyway so basically i'm gonna go through a little bit over the platform then i'll just do how do you sell put option so that's uh just a watch list then you have this is your main trading platform and it's beautiful if you look at that here you have all the all the ticker which you recently used this chart which is powered by trading view trading is an awesome platform and you have the same um, nice chart nice uh, chart uh, you can use one minute five minutes if you are doing like five or 15 minutes that's what you i suggest if you are doing intraday if you are doing multi-day probably like uh, four hour day uh, so this is nice so this is you can get a lot of an indicators to um, draw a trend line and do all those things here uh, basically like more than other things maybe i'll just go over uh, everything uh, you can do in weepool in next video but this video mostly i'm gonna do how do you sell a put so selling put so basically what you are doing is like let's say uh, let's take any example right um, let's say amd let's say right so amd is 86 right so why you want to sell put one thing is like by selling put you can make a premium so you collect it's just like insurance you are collecting insurance you're collecting premium so it's a free money so let's say you sold puts for this week which is gonna expire tomorrow so let's say you said um, you want to buy amd 86 you want to sell uh, put uh, sell put 86 one thing though to sell put you do need an collateral so which is amount um, amount like if you want to sell amd for 85 dollar you will need 8500 so if your account is small you probably want to uh, find the lot cheaper stock there are a lot of cheap i mean if you look at that intel which you can get for 5000 if you want to do uh, even 1500 2000 you can see neo uh, there's snap is pretty cheap and pretty good stock um, probably i won't suggest kodak but uh, uh, even uh, southwest love that's a uh, 3000 you can sell for um, so you know even if it, your account doesn't have to be like a lot of money you can even start smaller too um, you can do bank of america which is like uh, bank of america i don't know what's the price but if you look at that uh not bbc bank of america yeah if you look at that it's 25 so you can do 24 put which for you which you need 24 dollars so uh we were on amd i guess or intel one thing is like usually put so basically when uh, i'll try to find the stock which is uh, kind of significantly went down uh, for example today i sold puts on fsly so fsly so which is which was kind of down so i have this five minutes so if you look at that it went down up to 85 dollars it's kind of came up which is very nice and i actually had yeah i sold fastly like and i'm already profitable 140 uh yeah 140 dollars there 
so uh, yeah uh, so so how do you sell put so for example one thing uh, why you want to sell put is one thing is like let's say you want to buy f fastly right so instead of paying $90 you can sell put for let's say 85 or something 85 or 90 a um, um, lot of the tech stock uh, they can expire weekly so you have time one thing a lot of people is like hey what if like um, uh, you want to buy fastly but uh, you think it's gonna go up then you can even buy put at like let's say hundred dollars so uh, that way uh, if you go to options tab there you have all the uh, calls and puts we are doing puts so you have both you can have both calls or puts so it's just showing all the puts here you can select like how many legs you want let's say 20 means uh, leg is basically different strike price i'll make a video like some people were asking like what is strike price and all those terms like you have bid ask bid is somebody just uh, that's what kind of somebody wanting to pay and ask is basically somebody willing to sell at 185 you know and this is just bid is buyer ask is seller that's all and last it was executed 180 uh, percent change what's the mid range what's the volatility so volatility is very important like uh, based on like they just had a earnings and uh, it kind of went down swiftly so people are not sure things like earnings will have high iv uh, yeah so delta is basically a dollar move right so delta is basically a dollar move up or down um, how much it's going to impact so uh, that's what delta is so basically uh, like puts one thing is like you want to buy the stock you can do sell puts and make premium and other thing is like you're just trying to collect premium um, then you can do the same thing for example if you look at that this is 7 august so basically expiring tomorrow today is 6th so 7 august uh, this is put so right now running it 90 right but if you say 87 uh, let's say you want to sell puts for 87 which is um, a single fastly um, 87 7 august put you are not buying if you want to sell it so basically you're gonna sell you're gonna collect 90 dollars premium think about it like again it may go down i mean if it goes like 86 then you have to still buy the stock at 87 because that's what put means uh, that's what you are agreeing to do it but if it does not then you just collect 90 dollars in a one day which is pretty awesome if you i mean 90 dollars a lot of um, good money in a day so this is kind of high iv that's why but usually if you don't want to get assigned you want to probably want to get like further away uh, you can do this and uh, you know even if you think about like 80 probably not gonna happen but people are paying like 10 20 dollars uh, for that which is a one day it's gonna expire tomorrow so if you can make like 20 dollars in one day think about like if somebody is with a big account let's say somebody uh, somebody uh, who have like hundred thousand he literally can have ten options and again like i'm gonna I'll, I'll never suggest never go all 10 in one things you probably want to diversify and if you look at it this is like pretty high um, and uh, delta is 20 which is very uh, very good so basically it's like you are further away there's very less chances of uh, fastly going to 80 so um, you can look at the trends and everything and that's how you're gonna decide but you making like twenty dollars for ten that's like hundred dollars a day think about hundred dollars a day with the uh, with hundred thousand you are you are talking about like you know two three thousand a month that's pretty awesome so uh two three thousands um, so that's pretty pretty good money that's a salary almost for a lot of people so you can do that and a lot of people do that and this is one of the and sometimes you can get a little bit aggressive but you can actually be very conservative and still make money so yeah um, that's about it i mean that's how you sell puts just place an order so you are selling put you do need in collateral for, for in, in this case 87 dollars so it's gonna be 87 times 100 cause one option oh sorry yeah 
um, it's eighty-seven dollar. You are saying so. It's a hundred, hundred op, hundred. Uh, one option is hundred, hundred stock. So sorry, hundred stock. So it's gonna be. Uh, you will need eighty-seven hundred collateral, but you do not have to. If you have a small account, you don't have to buy the uh, fastly or something. So you can actually get a lot of cheaper. Cause Bank of America, pretty good, uh, pretty cheap, um, cheap stock and good stock too. You have AMD, um, decent run up. Uh, so Intel, um, I I sold some puts on that. I think I do have some stock, but I believe in that company. And you can find a lot of stock. So I can maybe kind of go over, uh, maybe kind of find a list of stocks which you can do. And there's other st strategy called wheeling. So what you can do is, let's say you get assigned at uh, 87, right? So you have 100 shares. Now what you can do is put that 100 shares in collateral and sell, call and collect money. So you can collect money path both way and kind of wheel it. So yeah, that's about it for today. Yeah, if you like the video, um, to like, comment, subscribe and ask me anything. I'm going to make uh, other video too. Uh, that's, it, that's it for today. Thank you.